Welcome to Storage Chasers. Yes, we are storage unit buyers and resellers. And if that is your thing, you have stopped at the right place. Uh, we are uh, about to head out on another adventure, so stay tuned. All right, this is a beautiful, really overcast day here in uh, South Carolina. As you can see, we got the trailer, we got the truck hooked up, ready to go. But no, we are not taking this today. Uh, we do have a unit that we uh, won that we're picking up tomorrow and we're gonna need the trailer for that one. But no, we're gonna take uh, the old little car. Uh, we picked up a small unit and because it's in the opposite direction that where we normally uh, go to to pick up the bigger units, we're gonna take the car today on Sunday after church because we all, you know, did the God thing first. Always gotta do that. And uh, tomorrow's Memorial Day. So we'll be picking up uh, the larger unit tomorrow. The facility is actually going to be open, so we have to go get it. They only gave us 48 hours to go pick it up. So yeah, we're going to be uh, picking up a little tiny unit. We may video it all at the facility, uh, but most likely we're just going <clears> to <throat> we're just going to pile it all into our car, into the trunk, the back seat, and everything else. We're hoping it's all going to fit in there, and uh, bringing it back, and we'll video it here in our wonderful yard. Uh, because it is Memorial Day and we have a family function that we're going to be doing. You know, everybody's got to do a little barbecuing, little hot dogs, little hamburger action. So we will be in the old uh, beast tomorrow. But uh, yeah, stay tuned for this one. Okay, we have made it to our destination. We uh, are here to pick up our unit. Give me a cart. Uh, we pick up this one here at a, or won this one online on uh, storagetreasures.com. Uh, we got won this one at uh, Public Storage here in Goose Creek, Goosey Creeky. And uh, we won this one for $20 and all, after all applicable fees, $21.60 out the door. And... Uh, so we're going to see what the unit is, 11.85, uh, that's 12, I think it's down here. So we're walking down, luckily it's a climate controlled. Uh, this is a, a manager unit, so uh, that should make it a little more interesting for us. So check out some pictures, had a few small things in here. Uh, what you see is what we got. You can see in this picture here, you see a stroller there, uh, a tote of something, uh, little plastic trays of something, and then uh, a little basketball court thingy for kids, another little drawer thingy, and uh, yeah. What else we got here? Uh, crock pot that always sells for us all right i think i'm in the right spot here yeah all right so there was all the pictures that you saw and here's the unit nice and dark 15 it says it says a 15 by yeah it says the 5 by 15 i guess that's 15 but it is a 5 but uh this was not in the pictures yeah and we brought our little car so we have to see if we can take this if not she said she'll keep it but we got to get all this other stuff i'm pretty sure all the rest of this stuff will fit in the car which will be nice um yeah but the cart not so much i don't know we'll see if we can squeeze it into our back seat but yeah we're gonna get this all uh, loaded up and we'll see you when it's emptied out whoo we all right one one eight five Empty out. Whew. Clean and swift. Wall to wall to wall to door. Better than when we got here. There is no light in here. That's a metal panel that's covering some screws that are sticking out. So there's nothing else hidden in there that I can see. So yeah. Uh, we didn't have to pay a deposit for this one because it's a manager special or manager unit. So all we got to do is tell them it's cleaned out and we can get on the road with our. <laughs> our pile of stuff and woo, I do enjoy having a climate controlled uh, building ones uh, especially ones that have carts too that's always helpful so that we don't have to try and fit our dolly and everything else inside this uh, 
this particular unit or inside of our, our car to unload the unit but like you saw this one had the had this stuff in there so she had had the door propped up for us we got that closed off and uh yeah we got everything <laughs> packed into the car <clears throat> piled up totally piled up everything's piled up in there and then uh our new cart is uh, strapped in here bungeed in hopefully that's going to be good enough to make it we may have to stop along the way and check it we have an hour and 15 minute drive so we're going to get on the road and we will see you when we get back to our home base operations all right welcome back to our home base of operations no we're not going into the trailer today <laughs> there is a unit in the trailer we'll be doing that that'll be our next video but for now got the car gotta get everything out of the car that uh, we got from the last unit starting to get some of it piled up here and uh got the whole back seat pretty full in here so yeah we're gonna get all this out of there and uh then we'll start to go through it so stay tuned okay we got everything out of the truck out of the tr trunk in the car and whatever we're gonna go through it really quick <laughs> one short video uh, as you recall this was in the unit uh this was not <laughs> in the pictures so we thought we could fit everything in the car and as you saw how we loaded this up this had to hang out the trunk just to make it back and we uh, had to strap it in there bungee it in there uh it's pretty cool well not minus the trash bags but i mean it's uh, uh you can actually take these off i guess if you wanted to they kind of flip around little trees you can flip around but uh yeah we're going to use it for like moving this stuff around the yard or moving stuff from the garden whatever yeah, it'd be fun <laughs> all right we got uh, two of these boards we got one here and we got one there i believe it was some kind of like table or something i don't know or a shelf maybe you know, it's like gets like legs between them or feet but then there's only holes on the bottom of that one the bottom of this one so i don't know how the legs would go in there but anyway that's what we got uh we got a uh a high chair uh table but there's no high chair so that's good uh we got this little adjustable basketball hoop thingy for kids uh pretty decent shape actually already so uh that should be able to be a good uh, flea market sale got a couple of toys here with it it's always good get some toys free toys free toys you got a uh, pillow in the case here's another bear another toy another toy stuffed animal uh it's got, still got the tag on it so it was 11 dollars for a snowflake teddy bear it's a christmasy bear it's got a number on it or a year i mean so yeah all right this doesn't feel very exciting to me probably gonna be miscellaneous junk that we don't need uh looks like some trash okay. yeah, we could always use another one of those um oh here's a little kid mat that's kind of cool drive little hot wheels around on it that might be fun uh what else is in here there's a, oh, a little plastic bat and there's a couple of dollies in here a heavy doll maybe it takes batteries or something yeah it looks like it talks or does something she needs to get her hair did but other than that she looks good here's a dvd box game it's empty oh there's another dolly in here this one's uh looks like a little princess of some sort all right and the rest just looks like regular trash uh we got this part of a stand we don't have the rest of it we just got that part of it uh, we got this three drawer plastic uh, thing <laughs> and uh, we took this one apart to get it to fit in the trailers or in the trunk and the back seat so here's a matching pillow that matches pillows somewhere uh, yeah one of those converse empty box uh, okay, training for somebody personal um, kid stuff Here's a leg that I think goes with 
with one of those table thingies over there. So we need eight of them. It's a picture. There's uh, one shoe. Uh, All right, this is a uh, military oriented. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Okay, these could be like the sock holder upper dealio thingies. But so far only one shoe. But that is it's a nice shoe. Alright, we got some toys. Some toys. We got a guitar. A couple of plastic balls. This goes with the uh, little hoop, probably. We'll sell those with those. And some socks and more of that. Next drawer here. We've got another pillow, We've got a toy, kid vacuum cleaner, looks like it takes batteries, so it's supposed to do something, but it's been on, so batteries are probably dead. There's uh, some kind of organizer basket thingy. Uh, here's some foam, uh, foam mats. And uh, more teddy bears and socks and another thing and another weird thing I think was supposed to have some kind of fluid in it and now it doesn't so that's even weirder and it's a little baby sock baby shoe here so there's a Carter's wish we had two of those that might be good right all right and we got a uh, one of these stuffed animal things apparently I'm supposed to look at the stuffed animals better because there's uh, some that are worth more I don't know by the tags or something I thought it was like Angry Birds or something. Uh, nothing. All right, this a uh, couple of diapers in here. There is some uh, some kind of medicine or something, probably kid medicine. Frankie's fun thing, so that don't mean much. Xylophone, that's always fun for kids. Fisher Price, that's a good thing. Pool floaty, little race car, some tag, paper, paper, trash, trash. And another little funny dude here that does something. Uh, but all three drawers are here for this. All the uh, the shelving pieces are here. That's the top. And then we got all these with all three drawers. This is the basket weave drawers. I uh, don't know if it's supposed to have a front drawer pull. I think it is. I think the other ones have. Yeah, it's got like this weird pull here. So we'll see if we can find that in one of the drawers that goes with this one. Because the other two drawers have them. So, if not, that'll be a small, small problem. But, uh, alright, what else we got? We got this kid toy here. It's a Disney Minnie Mouse thing. Also, looks like it may take batteries. Oops, it's an airplane -y type thing. It's got buttons and stuff and stuff. But it, I think it takes batteries in there, so... Yeah, we'll have to check it out and see if it's worth anything more than what we think. We've got... Fisher Price, whatever that is. Don't I uh, don't know. Mm, probably looks like it takes some batteries too. Some kind of kids toy. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, stroller. Strollers are always uh, are always good. Uh, this is a Graco. It's got one with the cent one tire in the front, two in the back kind of model. So it's uh, turns faster. Um. Most of these panels and pieces will come off and we can wash all that, so that'll be nice. I'm hoping this snaps back on here good. But, uh, yeah, all these pieces like this, either they unzip or unsnap, or I can uh, disassemble them to some extent and we could actually throw them in the laundry to, to clean all the parts. And uh, then we just wipe down all the metal, and uh, this will be some... Uh, some kid's uh, new ride right there. That may be what pays for the unit. No, no. All right, then we got this uh, unicorn rocking horse cow thing. Uh, yeah, kind of confused myself. Looks more like like a cow, but then it's got the unicorn horn. And uh, yeah, and you can buckle your kid in there and meet a fine cheap cheap pine wood here. So yeah, that's a. Uh, Somebody needs that somewhere. <laughs> and then uh, we got this. We got a, a Bible that's been left here by, it's been placed here by the Gideons. So thank you, Gideons, for giving us a Bible in there. 
And here's some more toys. And here's some more toys. Oop. And, uh, yeah, it's a, I thought it was a Barney, but it's a girl. Barney-ish thing, so I don't know. All right, uh, and then more toys. So another toy. Here's a leapfrog. Thing. Sometimes the leapfrog things work pretty decent. You get pretty good money for them. Uh, not an official nerf or nothing. So what is it? Oh, it's a water gun. So yeah, water guns right now will probably be good sellers for the flea market. In fact, we got a whole whole gaggle of them. So that'll be good. Another couple of electronic-y operated things here. Oh, there's a complete phone. So it just looks like more toys. And a couple of the bigger electronic things, the leapfrog things, are the maybe worth something if we can clean them up and test them. Maybe a maybe an eBay store type of thing. I don't know if that's brats or something maybe. Um, yeah, not up on my toys like I probably could be, but uh, that's it. And then we got the little playpen that all these toys are in. So that's kind of a good one. Let me go back over here now. All right, what else we got? We got this uh, crock pot. It's, uh, looks like it's pretty brand newish, <laughs> which is really nice. Uh, without the screw in there, put this in, and then it's got like little latches. So you actually latch this one closed like that, I guess on both sides to keep it in there huh that is pretty good so we will uh do a checker out on this thing test it see if it's uh, gonna work and see how much we can get for it uh this was a uniquer item um cover up some personal information this says that it is a a Nike ink stock one stock certificate of stock it's uh, framed in a nice little frame thing here it uh, looks to be official it's got all this information numbers on there and stuff and it says this certificate is transferable in cities designated by the transfer agent so I will have to look into that because I would uh, think it'd be kind of cool to own a own a piece of Nike but uh, we'll look into that. And then we did get a second one of these uh, three drawer Hooji thingies. And uh, this one was together and we just left it together. So we'll pull all the drawers out and go through them here. See what we got. All right, we got, uh, it looks like some adult Nike shorts. Here's the bag. Here's some Almost looks like a Polarider. It is a Polarider, but I don't know if it's Ralph Lauren's or not. It's uh, Beverly Hills Polo Club. All right, a little different. We got that. We got an Air Force jacket. I got, I think I have one of these listed right now on uh, our eBay store, so that'll be good. And uh, this looks like almost like matching pants for that jacket, so that would be even better. Here's another pillowcase, matches the other pillow thingy we have down there. Here's a book bag that happens to say marble on it, so that may be worth something. Here's a, here's this, a belt. It's a military belt for when you're running in formations. There's a, some supreme drawers. All right, these may be worth something. I'll have to look those up. The supreme is a, a decent brand, but... We'll see if people would actually buy something like that. Uh, Wonder Nation, just a long sleeve shirt, nothing spectacular there. Regular drawers. And uh, what's in this one? Here's just some sweatpants. It may be interesting, no tag. All right, what else? We got something here, got some here, and we got some money. We love finding money. So yeah, pour the money out in the, on the table. Uh, what is it? We got uh, 15 cents. There we go. 15 cents out of this unit already. It's always good. Alright, what's in box bag number, drawer number two? 
is uh, I love you son and uh, didn't leave love him enough to leave any money so no some personal pictures no um, don't know composition book some weird stuff there's some checks don't need that somebody's ID don't need that here's a mirror Oops. picture frame picture frame okay it's more personal and here's a hat Ooh, it says Nike so we got to try and clean it up plus it's one of them strap backy ones so we got to look this up and see Nike stuff will sell um, I said feel heavy oh there we go um, Air Force cap here's a remote control for something that we don't have that's always good to know some Air Force patches here's some smelly stuff that you can't read so we'll spray it and see um, yeah grossy all right here's some uh, cheapy glasses and uh, cheapy gloves maybe they're 3d so it was a real D so okay there's that the lid some socks one of those one of those another one of those a binky some kind of they're not beats or nothing are they I'm sure somebody will tell me what does it say I world uh, wireless thingies some allen wrenches yep we do like our tools here's some more money a little bracelet some uh, furniture pieces smelly that drugs always oh, got to see what's in the drugs and it's only drugs in this one I've heard of people actually putting their jewelry and money into these things so now we have to check at least a little bit of time but it's worth it glasses case feels empty which sucks because of more Ray-Bans <laughs> but we got the box which is a good shape and your little cleaner rag so yeah, we'll check into that there's a poker chip for uh, something let's see got some change we got another 25 55 45 cents will be a used condom wrapper and uh, there's their uh, their set of keys that they've been looking for so it's a nice truck keys but no and like I said the tools and uh, put the money I guess on the other table with the other monies and take that too maybe or something I'll dump it up last drawer last drawer where well, you can kind of already see it but you gotta pull it out and see what do we got we got another windbreakery type of thing champion c9 it's a nice windbreaker we just had people at the last flea market we were at asking for stuff like that asking for a, a windbreaker military pants yes military pants air force made expressly for the air force so we got some air forcey pants i don't know how they're different than other ones but they are this is apparently a black flat sheet there is a beach towel that has i don't know some disney movie i'm sure here is a goofy tie <laughs> yeah, literally um Where's that Pluto? Goofy Pluto. I can get him a. Anyway, it's a Disney thing. All right, we got. Uh, that was a California raisins, but it's got some. If they are, they're old raisins in there. Surfing and stuff. I don't know. Uh, I guess a small. All right, we'll look it up. Uh, <laughs> I give up on that one. All right, then we've got one of these, uh, Modern Amusement. Yeah, I'm not amused. And uh, here's uh, the Tiger King shirt. And it's got, yeah, it's got uh, tigers, lions and tigers and stuff on it. And here's a uh, OJ's knife and uh, some socks. Uh, there's another head warmer thingy. I don't know, one of those, oh, there's another knife. That's right, he did kill two people. So uh, There's another one of them. Some more money. Charm box. Some 10% awesome stuff. More money. More money. More money. And 
trash. So we got two of these uh, stackable things. It's cool. The crock pot. We got the, uh, the Nike stock. That's always going to be good. We got the stroller, the little rocking chair, horsey thingy, this little toy. Uh, like I said, the second one of these, we just put it together and it looks okay to me. Got some miscellaneous toys we'll just throw on the table and give away to kids as they walk by uh, at, the flea, at the flea market. The basketball hoop and the cart. The cart will probably end up keeping. Everything else will either be trash and or up for sale. So if you like that, then uh, hit us up. In the meantime, please like, share, subscribe, comment, all that other good stuff. We do have another unit that we're going to be going through right away uh, for us. But for you, it may not be out for another day that's in the trailer right now but uh please uh stay tuned so you can uh check that one out too it's got some interesting stuff and as always we will talk to you later